Hey guys, it's Joey Gaming. Welcome back to another video on Joey Gaming. Today I have a Slenderman story. Yeah, I have some Fortnite Season 11 gameplay. Well, it's technically Chapter 2, Season 1, but I'm calling it Season 11 because it's easier for me to say. So, this is my first game. I recorded my first game, so... Anyways, yeah, the... F um, the story time... I actually have two stories about the Slender Man. I used, so when I was younger, I used to believe in the Slender Man. So, yeah, I used to believe in the Slender Man when I was younger. So I have two separate stories, and most of them are, two of them are interesting. Um, if you guys are wondering, no, Slender Man is not real. He was made for a Photoshop contest, and, um, and then someone made it a creepy pasta, and then it became a thing, and then stuff happened and I'm making role plays about it and then now I'm here today talking about it so <laughs> yeah so you have to, um, make sure you guys leave your own comments about the slender man if you guys have any slender man stories uh, just let me know uh, just leave your slender man stories if you had sightings of slender man just let me know in the comments tell your stories in the comments below um can we stop for a minute and appreciate how awesome the music is like the um the, the music in this game's awesome i don't know who uh, made this song but it's absolutely amazing it, it really is also yeah this is my first game um some of the controls i had for this game were kind of screwed up i had to go and fix some of them so yeah i'm gonna be a complete bot for like two minutes so so um the first story took place a few years ago um at the time i was living at my old house um well these two stories i was living in my old house at the time um um i was like eight or nine and slender man was really big at the time so it was like 2012 2014 i w slender man was real big at the time uh, so I watched some of these videos about Slender Man and saw some sighting videos, so I thought it was real. I was so terrified of Slender Man when I was younger. Um, I thought I, um, I, I, when I would go outside just to get stuff out of the car or something, I would like run because I thought that's how terrified I was. Or to take out the trash or something and it's like at night. I would get, I was terrified of that too because I used to believe in the Slender Man and he would terrify me. Uh, because I was a young kid at the time, I didn't really think about, hey, this guy's probably not real and stuff. But, you know, I was super young, I didn't really know that. Um, so one day, I was feeling pretty sick, alright? Um, I did heard about something called Slender Sickness. So I was pretty afraid, and I was pretty much sick and afraid. I was sick, alright? I was laying on the couch, being sick. Um, I had like the flu, like flu, I threw up like a few hours ago, so I wasn't really that good of in a mood. I was asleep, I was a half asleep, then I wake up, and I see Slender Man's face in the window. Alright, I, I think I saw, so basically how my, uh, so basically how it, how it all works is there's a living room, alright? And there's a couch looking into the kitchen, and in the kitchen, there's a sink, you can see the, the, the sink. And above there, there's a window, and I saw this, um, white face, and it was kind of creepy. It looked like Slender Man a little bit, but I fallen asleep. The next day, I checked it out, and it wasn't really there. Um, it, um, I was uh, at the time, um, I was pretty terrified, but I didn't really care. I don't know why I didn't really care, but I did see that, but thinking back onto it, thinking back onto it I it could have been a uh, could have been a pot or one of those sensey things I don't know it was super strange also I was like half asleep so um maybe it's some weird nightmare or something I don't know but that's the first sighting all right of slender man I, that I saw in my life the second si sighting took place at a water park so basically, my parents used to run slash manage a water park, um, in my town, alright? Um, I'm not gonna say any names, but, uh, we, my parents used to own a water park, um, and one day, my parents had to go out, um, like, my parents would take us to this, to this water park that they own, because it's, because it's a, we get to swim there for free, basically, because they manage it and run it basically they technically own the place um 
Um, for some reason, my parents had to get out of town for a minute, and I we we were there. So what they did is they asked one of the lifeguards to like basically babysit us. Um, and that's what happened. And it was like really late, and my parents wanted us to go to bed because it probably won't be back until really late. So they wanted us to go to bed or something. So there was like a motel attached to it too. So we we slept in there. My I, t I was teased to my sister about a sign. So basically, one of the, you know the speed limit signs that said, "Hey, speed, um, drive around 25 miles an hour." Yeah, I teased my sister about, "Hey, that, look, it's Slenderman," and my sister freaked out about it. And um, and and then the person who was watching us is like, "Oh, that's not Slenderman," and the girl who was watching us said it wasn't Slenderman. And I, and after a minute, it's like, hey, maybe I know I was teasing my sister about it, but I looked at it, it kind of looked like Slenderman a little bit, because it sign those types of signs are white and stuff. So, but the next day, um, when our parents picked us up and took us home after that, after coming home uh, after that, the next day we went back and it turned out it was a sign. So that's the time that I saw uh thought Slenderman was a sign, and uh, yeah. So the next thing happens, um. Well, so there's like other sightings I saw about Slenderman, and um, one of the other signs is uh, basically I live in the mountains in Idaho. I live at, I live technically by the border of Utah and Idaho, and there's like mountains, and um, and and usually in the winter time, uh, these are like like markers for the plows, so they can see the plows, and and there are these markers so the plows can plow the mountains. And, um, and these poles would look like Slenderman, so every time we were coming, coming home from my grandma's house at night, we would drive past those markers and be like, hey, is that Slenderman? Oh, nope, nope, never mind, that's not Slenderman. So, that's my Slenderman story, don't worry, these got these were just tricks that my brain were playing on, Slenderman's not real. Anyways, guys, like and subscribe, got any stories like these, post them in the comments, because I will be...